Today we're in Clearwater Beach, Florida, on the boardwalk, steps from the ocean, about to walk the new hiatus with Nick and Haren Desai of 3H. It's a beautiful day. Let's go see it. Thank you for having me. Yeah. I get Balsa Brothers. I feel special today. This is great. Yeah. When can I get a shirt? Can I get a shirt? I want to be part of the team. Yes. You get a shirt. Where are we? Tell me where we are today and how did we get here? We're at the hiatus, Clearwater Beach. Who bought the dirt? Dirt guy? Right here. He, he likes to check. How did we get this spot? What was here before this? Uh, 33 room, mom and pop. Walk the hotel. How long do you have to sit on that? Five years. Five years? COVID in between? Yeah. You got to have a little patience. Yeah. Okay, so where are we? What is this? This is the beach walk. This is the, the beach walk that runs all the way down Gulf View Road. And then right behind that's the uh, beach and the ocean. Blue Water Beach is traditionally mop and pop, like this yeah. store and this yeah. store. It's just mom and pop. All the way down. So you guys are, and your neighbors. And the neighbors. And yeah. the neighbors are changing the yeah. look. Yeah, I mean, I think, uh, you know, the beach has many high-end hotels opened up in the last four or five years. Uh, we're just another addition to it. Development is fun, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Development is fun. Uh, let's go walk. Let's go. This is the heart and soul of the hotel. Uh, Check in right here. Lobby on the seven. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you, we got a meet code with a coastal floodplain. So we had to put parking and elevate, elevate our habitable space anyway. So Hiran's idea was let's maximize uh, sources of revenue and take it to the seventh floor where we got the best views. Uh -huh. This is amazing. And you know why seven? Why? My wife's nickname is seven. <laughs> Overrules are at the Y. <laughs> what if you got approval for eight floors? We have eight floors? No, no we seven. Turn it off at seven. No, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Talk to me about parking. No, parking is essential. We have parking on site, parking garage. Okay. Food and beverage outlets, it's a big deal to have parking on site. 100% valet parking. Within the hotel, we will have full food and beverage outlets. Because parking is a premium, I'm guessing, in Clearwater Beach. Yes. Yeah, so much. you built a deck and then built high rise construction or low rise? Mid rise. High rise. High rise construction. Yeah. Yeah, we got creative. We went New York style, added lifts. So how many cars can you park? 105. And we charge? $30. $30. Every car. Every car. $30 a car. Love charging. This is a great hallway, too. Light, bright window here. Yep. I mean, we don't see that a lot. So in normal hallways, you'll see them covered in maybe artwork. And yeah. uh, yep. all says, uh, this is our artwork. Yeah, I got a view of the beach right now. I, I, that's what I'd like. Every to floor as you walk along the hallway, you'll see the water. How many rooms? 88 rooms. All with ocean views, uh, 12 types of rooms. And we're gonna go see my favorite room right now. Go. Well. Yeah, this is a great room. Yeah, this is uh, one of my favorite rooms uh, at this hotel. The decor, upscale, fresh. We use Chilano Design Group out of New York. They did our moxie, they did this. Well, when you're a shop brand, you don't have a brand standard. So oh, sure. we don't, you know, it's not a prototypical room that's uh, designed for you by the brand. So the key elements for us is a comfortable bed and a great shower. You, you mentioned soft brand, no brand standards. I mean, you can feel it in here. This feels highly curated, highly designed. Going back to creating the experience again. Go in the morning, walk on the beach, come here, and then not leave. Do my work from here on my hiatus, at the hiatus. It's all about the hiatus. <laughs> What's right. the square footage of this room or a typical square footage? This one in particular is about 600 square feet. Kind of like you want to create your room at home. Where you have your closet in the bathroom, you have a his and hers yeah. space, and then you got living space here too. Having a shower with the right pressure, 
rain shower, the way I call it. Again, uh, the space is uh, created so uh, there's enough space for everyone. I love a good rooftop pool. Is that the money shot? That's the money shot. Is this shot. the money shot? That's the money shot. That's I the mean, money shot. I mean, that's a gorgeous beach. Like, is that world famous Clearwater Beach? Number one in the United States. Number one in the United States. I can see why. Obviously, we have a pool bar, Cielo. Oh, you got to have the bar. One yeah. of the four uh, food and beverage outlets. We have a great menu, uh, poolside menu. We have some great cocktails for the pool. Who manages this property? Uh, to dine for. That's us that created another venture, and we're going to do experiential hotels do the food and beverage. Uh, we've got quite a few in the pipeline, so we started to do our own food and beverage uh, management. Is that to make it more profitable or just control? Why, why are we doing that? Both. We just have to. Control, yeah, you have experience. to. Experience. Yes, and created the experiences from city to city. Fascinating. Who's that? A goddess. Just a goddess. Did Nick paint this? Local artist, uh, Donnelly. Amazing artist, local, does a great job. Yeah, that's amazing. You can see it all the way down the beach. Yeah. Quick story about this lobby and Hiren's favorite phrase of uh, revenue per square foot. Revenue uh, per square yeah, foot. Yeah, he, he actually had uh, the gym, the fitness center right here on the most valuable real estate that we had, uh, looking at the ocean. And in the middle of construction, we, we changed it. With ocean views on both sides. Oh yeah, windows on both sides. Windows on both, both sides, sides yeah. yeah. Took advantage of the ocean for sure. What's the name of it again? Ocean 7. Ocean 7. Ocean, seventh floor, your wife. Step. Get it, yep. get it. <laughs> okay, so we've talked about our four F&B outlets, right? What have we seen? We've seen Ocean 7 restaurant. We have Cielo, the pool bar. Yep. We have High Tide. The Tiki Hut, little box, revenue per square foot. Uh, what's number four? The fourth is the Sunset Bar and Terrace, where we're going now. This is uh, going to have the best sunset champagne toast experience in America. When did you open? Uh, four weeks ago. Four weeks ago. And dare I ask, how's business? Uh, it's been uh, strong. H haven't had time to, uh, for a ramp. It's a good yeah. problem to have. It's a great problem to have. Yeah, That's open, his understatement. Open, right, <laughs> in the middle, right in the middle of spring break. And uh, yeah, you're officially welcome oh, to the what three. Are you here. <laughs> <laughs> Give me this. I will take that. Part of the 3H family. This does make me a fan. Do I get a Do I get a shift? <laughs> when do I start? <laughs> yeah, you get you get a shift. But before that, we're going to do a toast. I love it. At the sunset oh, terrace. Who's here? Hi guys. Hi. It's good welcome to see to you. Welcome to the 3H family. <laughs> I feel I feel honored. <laughs> I feel very special right now. All right, everybody, grab a glass. Grab a glass. Nick Karen, family, thank you guys for having us. I mean it sincerely. I'm really glad we got to do this. I am very impressed. I love the project, I love the story, I love you guys. So, thanks for having me in the family, and cheers to success. Thank cheers, you. cheers, thank cheers, you. Cheers, 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 cheers. Cheers.